watching NBS live at one. Let's take more discussion into innovation now. Innovations remain one of the crucial elements for a business to strive amidst the COVID-19 pandemic. An indigenous startup with the help of the Uganda Industrial Research Institute has come up with an e-receipt system to improve the transport sector. Now, according to the proprietors, this will reduce the losses incurred while doing manual record keeping. Let's give you more. We provide solutions to transport operators and we extend the technology to support the customers who are the passengers. So from the operator side, there's need for our solution because of the challenges we found in their ticketing processes. And majorly, when they use the manual systems, we found out that they lose money. There's a lot of cash leakage. And we found out that it is not easy for them to balance. They don't have a digital track of any records. So you, you basically find everything is chaotic. Yeah, then on the passenger side, uh, it is more accelerated by the current pandemic. We are building these solutions for the passengers to be able to book online without going into the chaotic environment downtown, which is a little bit risky. Being uh, an innovation aiming at improving the transport sector, uh, URI comes in, uh, the team of programmers at URI come in to, to help in a optimizing, looking into whether the solution is uh, optimal, whether it is uh, 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 working efficiently, how the security uh, is taken care of, because we do not want people's information uh, leaking. It's helped us because it's very efficient, it's very fast. It has also helped us uh, remove all those uh, fake or counterfeit tickets because they come with a QR code and our ticketing officers will move in the train and scan the codes to ensure that they are genuine. This has uh, created transparency. It has easy transport. And secondly, it has helped us, those people who balance books. Reason why, when we are balancing books, previously we were counting, counting, getting a calculator and you first add up the money. But now that is by, by the time a bus reaches in Kampala, we've already banked the bus. Thank you.